And yeah, let's do this. So I'm gonna call um sensitive society on this phone. Seems weird, but it's legit. Nothing's here. The heck? <gasps> What's going on dudes? New day, new female to send to the streets. Now thankfully Sensitive Society isn't dead from the Rona yet. Give me a week, I'll probably pass away. But let's not think about that. You saw the thumbnail, you saw the title, you know exactly, exactly what we're going to be talking about. <laughs> I don't know about you guys, but to me, this never gets old. Sending women to the streets never gets old to me. And before anyone says it, oh Sensitive Society is just a big incel, he hates women. <laughs> if I see a man on Twitter who deserves to be sent to the streets, I'll send a man, don't care what race, or gender you are if you do something that's street worthy i'll definitely send you to the streets without even thinking about it without even blinking twice if you do something that takes you to the streets you know your boy will take you to the streets take a drink every time i say to the streets <laughs> <laughs> so my favorite page on Twitter, eGirls posting their L's online, tweeted this and I knew this was video worthy immediately. Let's get started. This thought, I mean this girl says, I just cheated on my BF for a lush eyes. I think I need rehab. <laughs> I'm Emily. I'm so quirky. I ran over five kids because I'm an Aquarius. <laughs> so like you, I had no idea what the fuck a lush eyes was. I thought it was a drug. <laughs> <laughs> because if you're cheating on your BF, I mean, you shouldn't even be doing it in the first place. So I looked it up. In a nutshell, Lush Eyes is a scent. I don't know if you guys know, but when you vape, you have a little liquid. And there's a lot of flavors. Cinnamon, apple, you name it, they have it. And this is a watermelon flavor. That's what Lush Eyes is. Lush Eyes is V-God's signature watermelon candy flavor infused with a fresh breeze of menthol. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know what the fuck that is. Upon exhale, a mixture of melon flavors infiltrate your taste buds and provides a smooth, cool, and fruity all-day vaping experience. Low Key, wanna try a lush ice now. <laughs> <laughs> I'll cheat on anyone if they give me a pack of lush eyes. For the record, I don't vape. E-girls posting their L's online said, What no father does to a motherfucker. We gotta go back to the image because this is one of the most thought things I've ever seen. I just cheated on my boyfriend for a lush eyes. We've established what a lush eyes is. Then she says, I think I need rehab. Is she glorifying rehab? Rehab is not a pleasant place to be. You're not supposed to glorify it. Oh, I think I need to go to the Arkham Asylum. I'm so quirky. Oh my god, I just killed five African babies and I chopped their heads off and I ate them and I pissed on them. I'm an Aquarius, so I guess that's fine. I don't care if this is fake or satire or real. It really doesn't matter to me because you're a clown. You're one of the biggest clowns I've ever seen in my life because you're not only promoting cheating, romanticizing rehab. Like, ooh, ooh, rehab is so dope, guys. Everyone should go to rehab. Everyone should become an alcoholic. Like, no, no, please stop. But let's assume this is real. If it turns out this girl cheated on her boyfriend for a lush ice, an ice pack, whatever the fuck it's called, you need to be sent to the streets because a three pack of lush eyes cost about $20. So that means that she cheated on her boyfriend for about $6.50 for each lush eyes individually. But let's say $20. Fellas, will you throw your relationship away for $20? <laughs> like if you're going to cheat on someone, you might as well get a fucking house. You might as well get a fucking mansion. But for a 1999 three pack of watermelon flavor vape? I mean, you have to be something else. Yeah. Someone said WTF is a lush eyes. Eagles responded with don't know doesn't matter. She cheated on her boyfriend to acquire something that's an L if I've ever seen one. Heart agree, my guy. The people here don't know what a lush size is. We've talked about it. We know what it is. We know it's price. It's $20. I hope, I pray to God, Sensitive Society is getting trolled once again because I just can't keep this up. I can't stand these hoes who are cheating on people for a fucking vaping flavor. If I were to cheat on someone, I will make sure I get a fucking Mustang or a fucking Cyber Truck, but a fucking $20 vapor flavor? You're dumb. Before we wrap it up, I want to show you this. Me at 15 being offered coke cocaine cocaine it goes in your nose <laughs> yeah that cocaine uh, at a party and accepting because i thought i was cool okay so drugs aren't cool i don't know who told you cocaine was good <laughs> i don't know why i said it like that i don't know who told you that's good drugs are not cool drugs do not make you epic as a matter of fact if you have friends who peer pressure you into taking drugs they're not your friends they're probably going to be dead in five years in the fucking freeway in la especially if you're 15 like at 15 please don't take drugs just play some fucking xbox play some halo there's a lot of things you can do. Become a fucking YouTuber for God's sakes, but don't do drugs. So this girl posted this TikTok, very iconic queen, yes queen. And then she said, me now, 18, having a lost vital portion of my childhood, put my family through complete emotional and financial turmoil and created an ongoing list of friends who never made it out. I mean, what do you expect? You hang out with a whole bunch of drug dealers and drug users. You don't really expect them to be successful people. No, they're junkies. They're
for people who belong to the streets, like unironically and legitimately belong to the streets. And that was the end of the video, guys. I gotta go pee now. But before I do that, I want to give a shout out to this person who did some fan art of me. It says Sensitive Society fan art I drew. Thank you very much. It looks sick. It looks very caliente, very sexy. I appreciate you, dude. You're the GOAT. And if you want to send me any fan art, DM me on Twitter or Instagram. My links are in the description. And yeah, thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you tomorrow. See ya.